straighten ourselves out here. So, I got to uh, shave for this photo shoot. I was trying to um, do it yesterday, so I didn't have a bunch of cuts and stuff, but naturally, I had no time to be able to do it, so I'm going to do it now. thing is that when I tell people I have no time that I have to make an appointment with myself to shave, people somehow think I'm bullshitting and I find it fascinating through this whole process that people think I'm exaggerating all the time when I say I have no time or that I have to make an appointment once a week just to shave. That's only once a week, because I can't do it more than once a week. I don't have enough time. So, um, I find it fascinating that people think I'm lying or exaggerating. It's like so much bullshit. Um, they, they, oh, it, it, I'm always met with these looks of like, oh, um, of course you can make time. Of course you can make time to clean your house. Of course you can make time to shave. Of course, of course, of course. They just don't believe me. <laughs> which, I, which I find um, interesting, to say the least. Um, wow. This looks like shit because I, had to, because I haven't shaved. Um, because I haven't had time to. And I haven't shaved since last week. And so it hurts like shit every time. And I gotta keep cleaning off the razor every two seconds. Um, for some reason, almost every time I've shaved in the last six weeks, Dan, the bottom line twin, has been around and ends up. And it happened three times in a row where Dan just happens to be here when I'm shaving and has a question or a this or a that or whatever. Um, kind of funny. This razor sucks. But I don't have time to go get another one. Um, feeling that this photo shoot is going to come up quicker than what I need to do now is I need to get the car after I shave, go to Kai's house, drop off the videos that he wanted, then I need to go to Home Depot and get string, which I forgot the other day because I've got to string up those fucking tomatoes. It's now Wednesday and I have not got a chance to string up the tomatoes yet. And I'm going to get me sun scalded every goddamn day on those more tomatoes. And I don't have time to do it. I haven't had time to do it. I barely had time to be able to water anything. So, I got this enormous beard going, which only makes me look like I'm 112 years old. Um, but part of the reason I left this was because I didn't have time to shave it off. <laughs> so, it's the same reason I grew the beard last summer was because I didn't have time to shave. 
So I just said, fuck it, I'll just grow a beard. Um, and naturally, when I started the beard, I even asked the guy at the farmer's market how he keeps his beard trimmed uh, tightly uh, because the idea was to keep it like a, a, a sort of tight beard. <laughs> and then, naturally, uh, because I don't have time, uh, uh, it turned into a big goddamn ZZ Top uh, deal, you know? <laughs> because the idea of maintaining it even once a week just slipped through the, through the ether. Uh, oh, man, this hurts. Maybe I might only shave half of it and then go out and get another fucking razor because this thing is fucking ripping my skin off. Uh, oh, I might even have another razor. Shit. This is a two pack, I think. Let's see. That'd be cool. Was around here somewhere. Where would I put it? Not in the left. Well, no idea. But I think what I'm going to do is <laughs> stop at this. <laughs> looking like I'm Lennon and, and uh, and, uh, screw it. I don't think anybody at Home Depot would care anyway. Uh, definitely look like Lennon at this point. Nice ear hair. Terrific. See, that's, it's shit like that that really bugs me. Like, you know, it's hard enough getting older now, but then... When you get things gross shit like ear hair, and then when I don't have enough time to maintain it in any kind of uh, reliable fashion, and it turns long enough to be able to braid, uh, <laughs> that's just uh, too much, you know? too much to bear. Well, this looks... Okay, to go out and get another fucking razor. Photo shoots from one to three. I was debating about whether to shave at all, but then everyone's like, "Oh, you're gonna clean up, right?" Like, yeah, why? Why not just look like a, a grizzly bear? Represent myself with a level of accuracy here. Yeah. Sanders with this big bush. 
Nice, big white bush. Starting to see uh, too many white pubes for my uh, for my liking at this point. Now that we're on that subject, what's it gonna be like when all my pubic hair is white? That's when you know you're old. When all your pubic hair turns white. Okay, kids. Ciao. I'm gonna go get a goddamn laser.